They are supposed to protect you on the inside and keep the thieves out. You have fences around, people put alarm systems on the doors, they want to feel safe. But these traditional tools won't keep you safe from the cyber crook. If you have a computer with internet access, you're a potential target. The information you're finding on these computers is better than dumpster diving. When you buy stuff online, even if it's a secure connection, a thief can still steal your identity. There are computer programs called keyloggers that record everything you type on your keyboard. People would be surprised what information is being captured. Keyloggers are hard to catch. Many programs self-destruct once they collect your personal information. The thief can hide the keylogger program in anything an email, music, even inside a piece of hardware, like this keyboard adapter and this wireless router. But your computer doesn't even need to be infected to be at risk. If you can get online at home with a wireless computer, you could be a victim. They'll even put guard dogs in the yard, uh, but then they'll turn right around and they'll put a wireless network system. Houston police officer Nick Drehill demonstrates what a thief can do. He downloads this free program from the internet. Every time you hear this, the program finds a home with a wireless connection. Over and over again, we find unsecured wireless connections. There are open doors for a thief to hack into your computer. I'll capture everything that they've typed and sent over. That means passwords, usernames, bank account numbers, anything that can wipe you out. We found the owner of one unsecured wireless network at home. How you doing, sir? Were you aware that it was unsecure? No, it was not. Richard Campbell not only uses his wireless computer for personal use, this is also his work computer. And no bars are going to keep a hacker from getting everything inside his machine. Now I'm very concerned. In fact, this, this weekend I'm going, I was thinking about uh, updating my software for that kind of protection and I'll make sure to key in for that specifically. To prevent identity theft, Drayhill says be sure to encrypt and secure your wireless network. The manual will tell you how. Consider buying a firewall. Always update your antivirus and spyware blockers. Before you throw out your computer, make sure you wipe out the information on your hard drive completely. There's software you can buy that will do that. There is another method that will protect you and it costs you nothing. Before you get rid of your computer, take out the hard drive and remove it, then destroy it. Before you recycle the rest of your computer or throw it away. Police say when it comes to protecting your identity from increasingly savvy thieves, you can never be too careful. Elizabeth Lee, CW39 News.